We all experience a bad night of sleep occasionally and that's perfectly normal. But how can we enhance both the quantity and quality of our sleep? Here are 6 scientifically bad tips for your better sleep. First up is regularity. Going to bed and waking up at the same time every day is crucial. Regularity anchors your sleep, improving both its quantity and quality, regardless of whether it's a weekday, weekend or you've had a bad night. This is because our brains have a master 24 hours clock that thrives on consistency, including our sleep-wake schedule. While many of us use an alarm to wake up, few of us use a two-bed alarm, which can be quite helpful. The second tip is temperature. Keep your bedroom cool. Your brain and body need to drop their core temperature by about 1 degree Celsius or 2 to 3 degrees Fahrenheit to fall asleep and stay asleep. That's why it's easier to sleep in a cooler room than a warmer one. Aim for a bedroom temperature of around 65 degrees Fahrenheit or around 18 degrees Celsius. It might sound cold, but it's necessary. Next is darkness. We live in a society that often lacks sufficient darkness, especially in the evening. Darkness triggers the release of melatonin, a hormone that regulates sleep timing. In the last hour before bed, avoid screens like computers, tablets and phones. Dim half the lights in your house and you'll be surprised at how sleepy this can make you. Consider using an eye mask or blackout shades to help regulate melatonin. The fourth tip is to avoid staying in bed awake for long periods. If you have been trying to fall asleep for about 25 minutes or you have woken up and can't get back to sleep, get out of bed and do something else. Your brain associates your bed with wakefulness if you lie there awake for too long. By getting up and only returning to bed when you are sleepy, your brain will eventually reassociate your bed with sleep. The fifth tip is to manage your intake of alcohol and caffeine. Avoid caffeine in the afternoon and evening and don't go to bed too tipsy. Both can significantly impact your sleep quality. The final tip is many of us expect to fall asleep immediately after turning off the lights. But sleep doesn't work like a light switch. It's more like landing a plane. It takes time for your brain to descend into sleep. In the last 20 to 30 minutes before bed, disengage from screens and do something relaxing. Find a routine that works for you and stick to it. Lastly, if you have a sleep disorder like insomnia or sleep apnea, these tips might not be enough. Just like a sports coach can't improve your performance, if you have a broken ankle, you need to address any sleep disorders first. Consult your doctor if you think you have a sleep disorder. In summary, sleep is essential, almost like a life support system. Following these tips can help improve your sleep, but if you have underlying issues, seek medical advice. Thanks for watching. If you found these tips helpful, please give this video a thumbs up and share it with anyone who might benefit. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell so you never miss out on our latest content. Sweet dreams and see you in the next video.